plenty of people on the moonwalk today by Ooh. the river. This was shot by WDSU photographer Brian McCann. What a great day to get outside and enjoy the breeze and the mild sunshine. It was nice. I wish I was there. I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chamber of Commerce weather. And wait, look, there are the sailboats. They're coming into harbor. I was trying to figure out what they are. Optimus, that's what my kids used to sail. And my daughter loved it as long as the wind wasn't blowing. I know. So if you've been sneezing, <laughs> I have. What's causing it? Well, now it's the weed pollen. You know, we had that bit of rain. We're starting to warm up. All of the flowers are growing. And then the trees are still leafing out. So you've got all of that pollen in the air too. Not grass pollen just yet. The ground needs to warm up a bit more. So here's what's happening. We have that weak cold front moved through last night. It's now well offshore. High pressure giving us beautiful weather across southeast Louisiana and south Mississippi. Another cold front moving our way. It's going to be pushing through as you go into early Sunday and that's going to just give us another beautiful day. Out on the west coast you can see this big upper level low that's going to begin to move on shore cause an area of low pressure to develop and that's going to be changing our weather especially Wednesday and Thursday with strong southerly winds. But right now, it's gorgeous. It's going to stay beautiful all the way through the weekend. Now, in the morning, that potential that you could have a little bit of patchy fog. High temperatures tomorrow, low to the mid-70s. Then, as you go into Sunday, another beautiful day. There's that weak cold front that just kind of gets into the area. Highs, low 70s. But Monday, the weather begins to change. We pick up more of a southerly flow. That means warm, moist air moving in. A few more clouds and an isolated shower. Look at those highs. I mean, we're going to start warming up. Here are the days we're most concerned with. We're watching Wednesday. Rain moves in. Here we are Thursday morning. We still have rain. And then we go into Thursday afternoon. We still have rain. And then here we are late Thursday night. And there's still rain in the area now. It's lingering into Friday. So that potential that we could have locally heavy rain. Here's the setup with the low moving to the east and that strong onshore flow. The potential that you could also have some coastal flooding. But the weekend looks great. Highs, low 70s, morning fog, and then that increasing rain and wind as you go into Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, even Friday. The high so far today, 70 degrees all across the area near 70 degrees. Now in the morning, it's going to be kind of chilly, that potential for fog in the morning, and then noontime, upper 60s, 3 o'clock, low to the mid 70s. Ditto for your Sunday, Monday, that slight rain chance, and warmer, upper 70s. Here we are looking at the week. Wind begins to increase Tuesday with a chance of rain, but it's Wednesday and Thursday into Friday that we'll have those higher rain chances with windy conditions.